yeah, we, we're making uh, our own whiskey. It's called the Sassenach. It's uh, it's going to be released in in the U.S. in uh, December, uh, and then we're working on uh, European distribution, which should hopefully be in the new year. And uh, tell me a, a bit about what style is it? What flavour profile? How, how did it come about? Yeah, it's uh, we've got an exclusive here. It's actually um, it's going to be a blend. It's going to be our own blend. I, you know, a great fan of, of Scottish, you know, single malts and. You know, I've always been exploring them, and certainly with you guys at the Scottish Malt Whiskey Society, have some some fantastic um, single malts. But I've always really enjoyed, you know, a lot of the the new Asian blend. And uh, I just realised, you know, I think that that's the sort of direction to go in. You know, we're not having we're not restricted by, you know, age or by, you know, something coming from a single uh, single batch. You know, yeah. we can really create something that's unique, and that's that's what we're trying to do with our whiskey. It's something unique and uh, and special. Yeah. And the name? Yeah, Sassenach, which is a probably slightly derogatory term. Um, my character uses it for, for the woman he loves, and actually it's sort of stuck, and the more we thought about it, the more we thought it really worked, you know. It's this unique kind of individual, and you know, the outsider, and I feel like that's what we are, you know. We, we started this project and didn't know an awful lot, and still probably don't know enough, but... Yeah, we want to make something very, very special, and our, our symbol is the is a unicorn, obviously quite a unique animal that was also a national national animal of Scotland. Yeah, uh, I think it's important that the whiskey is also sort of updated and kept fresh and new. And yeah. um, we found that a lot of Scottish whiskey was kind of dated, and uh, the approach to it, you know, is yeah. is very sort of sacred and. It's, it's slightly old school, so we wanted to, to update it more and make it more modern and accessible. Actually, as my travels around, around the world, I've been finding, you know, it's something that reminds me of home and uh, it's something I, I look forward to wherever I travel to, trying a whiskey and, and it always takes me back to Scotland and that's yeah. what we're trying to create with Assassinac. You know, it's the spirit of home. It's something that, right. that takes you back to, to familiarity. Yeah. And Coucou les addicts, c'est Aurélie du site Outlander Addict et j'ai un message pour vous. Si cette vidéo vous a plu, n'hésitez pas à vous abonner à la chaîne, à mettre un like ou à partager cette vidéo sur vos réseaux en cliquant sur le bouton partager qui se trouve juste en dessous. Pour prolonger votre expérience, je vous encourage à visiter régulièrement mon site internet outlander-addict.com. Vous y retrouverez des traductions, des articles et plein d'infos et d'actualités sur Outlander. A très bientôt.